Reading the intro he wrote for himself could potentially cause problems. <laughs> Justin Reynolds, he is from Brooklyn! Yeah. Now, then I have to skip over the next paragraph because there's an arrow that goes down to the bottom. <laughs> where he writes, he stalks me at other comedy clubs, which is fucking creepy because it's true. <laughs> you guys aren't getting the gist of this. This kid actually does stalk me at one of the other comedy clubs and then came over here and wrote in his intro that I'm saying that he stalks me. <laughs> That's the only reason I'm reading this intro. It's half a fucking confession. <laughs> and I have like a hundred of you here as proof. Should I end up in the paper anytime soon? All of you can be like, yeah, I was there during the fucking introduction. And he did confess to stalking. So he stalks me at the other clubs and he thinks I'm trying, he's trying to be my apprentice or something, which is the fucking best case scenario. That's not what I think. <laughs> but he is a funny young man. Rookie of 2010, he is performing at clubs all over New York City and he does mention that he is very handsome. Give it up for Justin Ramos, everybody. I thought admitting to the problem was the first step. So, you know, I just found him attractive. Doesn't he look like the naked cowboy? Just a little bit. I love you, Josh. Thank you. Um, so, yeah, New York is really crazy. How many Matrix fans do we have? Yeah. Yeah, the Matrix was crazy. Now, the reason why I say this is because dope fiends, they were the original inventors of the Matrix. Have you ever seen a dope fiend? Seriously. Their balance is retarded. Like, they should use them as, you know, the stunt doubles, because, like, Neo is not the one. They are. Like, no, seriously. These motherfuckers, they'll be there, like... <laughs> and then, like, they'll go all the way down. Only time you see them snap out is when they see a dollar. They... Am I lying? They all got those shriveled up faces. Raspy voice, oh damn, I'm looking down at this. It's crazy. Oh uh, man, I thought I'd share that with you because New York is a stinky, filthy place, but it's beautiful. <laughs> Dirty man, hot dogs, it's crazy. Hope you guys didn't order any hot dogs here at Caroline's. They're great, they're great. No, really. Um, what's going on in the headlines today? Uh, um, isn't, uh, what is it, WikiLeaks? You guys, you know, Wikipedia? The government, we're, we're in trouble, you know? All of the lies that they told us, black people still on free, it's crazy. Obama, you know, you got some splendid to do, splendid to do. How many of you guys have jobs in here? That is sad, the rest of you guys are some Call of Duty, lazy, Halo playing bastards, okay? Don't blame the Mexicans for taking all the jobs, you better take notes, okay? They stand at every Home Depot, in this type of weather right now, they're outside now <laughs> with their cervezas. Yeah, it's true. It's true. Um, any Kanye West fans in the building? Listen, fuck Taylor Swift, okay? That shit was funny, all right? Beyonce's hot, okay? Her ass is amazing, okay? He's smart, though, because, you know, he fucked up with that. He got blackballed. Then he drops an album against a, uh, there's a Down Syndrome rapper, Nicki Minaj. <laughs> Come on, she's whack. Come on, think about it. Like, she's like, I'm the hottest in the game. <laughs> like, Kanye West is smart, you know? Oh, wow. It's crazy. The only thing they have in common is they both wear tight pants. His third leg is showing, her butt pad is showing. It's crazy. Like, and then, you know, she made recent headlines because Regis Feldman, like, he just groped her ass on live television. What? And Kelly's like, Regis! He's like, what? She has a fat ass. Are you jealous? Because, I mean, this is Kelly. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. Um, what else is going on in the world today? Harry Potter. Any Harry Potter fans? How do you break up the last book into two movies? I mean, it's great. You know, Alakazam, yeah. It's great. Um... I love Harry Potter, that's just not mine. I play with like little twigs that my dog pisses on and go outside and be like, Expect the Patronum! And then my wife's panties drop, it's amazing. <laughs> These spells work. Um, but before I get out of here, I'll leave you guys with this. Bush is also in the headlines. Exactly. 
He thinks because he stand next to, he's standing next to Barack that um, change is going to come. We already made up our minds about you. The title of your book should be I Fucked Up America. What you going to do? <laughs> Thank you, guys. My name is Justin Ramos. Thank you, Linda. Justin Ramos. Keep it going for my stalker, Justin Ramos. A little extra for a stalker. You can't, I know that you had a lot of stalkers and it makes no sense. No more what? No more taxes? Okay, thanks for taking a stand. As I was watching Justin, I thought to myself, if this guy doesn't stop taking a stand on taxes, I'm gonna shut the fucking microphone off. Okay, so was there a reason for that? Did I miss something? You going through for a hard time right now that I didn't know about? <laughs> Did you make, or you forgot it? Okay, so anyway, my next question was pills and stuff. Is everybody an alcohol drink, drinker? Is